uh, you know, the, the big star was the stadium, certainly, and our fans. Uh, it was loud in there, which we're excited about. We hadn't played in there before. Uh, and I thought our players played to the level uh, of, you know, the, the situation. And, you know, coming into the new stadium and uh, the fans excited. The player, I think the players were excited. Uh, we obviously made mistakes. Uh, and, uh, you know, we'll work to correct, it, correct those. But, uh, you know, I saw a lot of good things. I thought our, I thought our first group, um, uh, I don't know how many yards they made, but they made quite a few yards and in the, in the, in moved the football well in our defense had a lot of three and outs in this game. So, uh, you know, Tennessee's a good football team and uh, uh, they're a tough test, but I, you know, I was, I was glad that we uh, made a step forward this week. We didn't look that good last week. Our backups didn't look that good last week. So uh, I thought a lot of those guys came through. Uh, we saw quite a few of them. Well, you, Coach, you were totally dominating in time of possession tonight. Yeah, we, you know, we want to be able to control the football. Uh, you know, part of it's a running game. Uh, part of it's uh, certainly Tony being able to throw the ball. I mean, uh, you know, make first downs. And uh, he throws it to a lot of different receivers, but certainly, uh, you know, I thought Roy Williams and, and Witten, uh, you know, they, he, he can go, it looks like he can go to them and make first downs in uh, critical situations. Uh, so, uh, but I mean, all of them contributed. He threw to Creighton, he throws, you know, you know, Bennett made some good plays. I, I, uh, you know, our running backs look good. So, um, you know, I thought it was a good good performance overall. Like I say, we, we made some mistakes that we don't need to make. We, you know, we have fourth and inch and end up trying to kick a field goal and miss that. So we cost ourselves really seven points uh, right there. So, I, you know, we did make mistakes. Same thing defensively. We, we shut them down a long time. And then we had a, we had a bench penalty, which, um, talk to the league about, but, uh, you know, uh, that got them going, and, and, of course, they made some plays, too. What happened on that penalty, Wade? Who was it on? Uh, well, I, I don't want to go into it because I, I'm going to talk to the league about it and uh, see, you know, why we would have a penalty in that situation. What's your comp complaint, man? Well, there wasn't a penalty. There wasn't a penalty. There wasn't anything. Uh, uh, you know, I, I'll go into it with the league. Did they say you said something? I didn't say anything. No, I mean somebody on the bench said something. Is that what it was? Well, that, that's what that, that's what they said, but you know, I, I just don't agree with that. So I'm gonna I'm gonna ask the league about it. Well, you talk about the uh, dimension that uh, Felix Jones brings. Uh, well, Felix, you know, I mean, uh, you can see that how explosive he is and how explosive our offense could be. I mean, we had the ball with. What a minute left in the half, and, and went right down the field. And, and of course, he made a big play, and then scored on uh, with five seconds left. So, um, and I thought our offensive line. I mean, you know, we we decided to run the ball with five seconds left. We did have a timeout, but you know, uh, the chances of you uh, not make it and have another play uh, are not good. So, uh, we had a lot of confidence in our offensive line, especially the right side there, and uh, and Felix running the ball. So. Uh, but those things will come up during the year, you know, and, and that's uh, that was good work, good work for us and good, I think, good confidence for our guys. Penalties are part of the preseason, but you have three by veterans players: Palumbo, Bird, you know, for the second week in a row, and Sensible. Well, we, you know, that's that's something that you continually work on. We had one, yeah, we had one on a, uh, we had a couple in the kicking game, as as did they, but. Uh, but I'm worried about ours, so uh, we'll continually work on the, those things. Is there any concern about your special teams? No, I mean, uh, you know, uh, we had we had it looked like we had three guys miss the tackle on the one on the one, uh, but uh, you know, I'll have to look at it and analyze it and see. We we did play a lot of guys and different guys on, on special teams that that we um, you know we, we we had to look at. So uh, some of them did good, some of them didn't. Did Jenkins misread the coverage on the touchdown? Pardon me? Did Jenkins misread the coverage on no, the touchdown? No, it wasn't Jenkins at all. So. Where is he on the line? That was it, it, You know, I, I don't want to go into specifics on who did this and who didn't do that, you know. I'm more looking I mean, for a general. It was a call is what it was. I made a bad call and they scored. Wait, it looks like. I was more looking for just generally in camp. How is he progressing from last year? Who's that? Jenkins. Uh, he he's doing well. He got hurt in the game. He hurt his ankle, and 
probably shouldn't have been in there as long as he was. So, uh, uh, so we ended up taking him out. And it's the same ankle, and it's really the same thing. So he should be well pretty soon. Wade, it looked like um, Tony had a smile tonight. Is, is his demeanor the, where you want it to be? Does it look like he's enjoying himself now? Well, he, I thought I thought he did well last week too. You know, uh, you know, he had good protection. Uh, you know, he, he makes plays, and, and uh, that's what we expect, and that's what he expects. Did you get a sense? Pardon me. Yeah, Newman was fine. How do you yeah. think he played, played um, You know, I, without looking at the tape, I mean, you know, we played some man to man, and they didn't complete very many passes. So, uh, especially the first however many series. So, uh, you know, our pass defense looked pretty good. You talked about the crowd. Did you get a sense the energy level was higher to start the game with your team? Our players were nervous going into the game, <laughs> you know, and. Uh, uh, I mean, you're a little bit nervous going into any game, but but uh, uh, they they uh, several of them said, talked about butterflies, you know. Mm -hmm. So uh, I knew they were, you know, excited about the stadium and the crowd. What about you, butterflies? Um, yeah, I mean, I, I was I was looking forward to it, but I was looking forward to it because we didn't play as well as I'd like to play last week, and um, overall, uh, and uh, you know, hoped our team would step up, and I thought thought they did. Wait, what about uh, the scoreboard being as slow as it is, the one overhead? Is that going to be a, a regular problem on punts? Uh, you know, I think the guy tried to hit it. I mean, I, <laughs> I, I don't think the ball would have gone 30 yards the way he kicked it. You know, it just looked like to me he was going to try to see if he could hit it, but maybe that wasn't the case. But anyway, uh, uh, I think Steven said there is, you know, you can move it, I think. Uh, but most of the time, you're kicking outside the, you know, you're directionally kicking outside of it, and it, it, it isn't a factor. So uh, the league minimum is, I think, 85, and we have it at 90. So uh, we'll just we'll work with it and see. Wait, how important was it to come after that the long drive and the penalty just to hold them to a field goal? Is that 